Paramedics treat a woman next to her submerged car, which moments earlier very nearly became her tomb. Towards the end, it's like I was starting to sort of freak out a bit that she, you know, she, we're not going to get it in time, but thank God that we got there. The 60-year-old had reversed her Holden through not one, but two neighbours' back fences before landing it in a pool. She was stuck inside. Her neighbours dived in and worked frantically to save her. She was trapped. The doors were all locked. We had to bust all the windows of the car. The woman was rushed to Liverpool Hospital in a serious condition and now owes her life to her quick-thinking neighbours. Efforts to save the woman actually took several minutes and while initially she was only waist-deep in water, by the time the rescue was got to her, her head and body were entirely submerged. Another 30 seconds, I think she was gone. Really? Um, the, the cabin was full of water. Oh. She, she was basically floating, or well, she was, she was floating in water. Initial investigations suggest the woman simply hit the accelerator instead of the brake. Very good driver normally, but today I don't know what happened. Underwater and the smashed windows yep. show just how hard rescuers work to get into the car. And police already say that Bill and Joe will now be put forward for bravery awards. You're a hero. Well yeah. done. Yeah. Thanks. Tom Steinford, Nine News.